here's one of the 15 baby chickens we're raising on our farm. And this is one of the five ducklings that we're also raising. Here's, here's the, the Wexler, Wexler family, family birdhouse. All right, let's go in the barn and check out what's in there. Take the food. Put that baby down so it goes back to its mommy. Rakhav is in the room by herself, so we have to wait. I have a bruise now. Yeah. So all of these stalls have a hay in it, and we spread it out so that they can give birth, and it's comfortable. And we've taken away the placenta. So no animals come. Why do you take the placenta away from it? Uh, so placenta is like the, the yolk for live babies when they're still giving, when the mom's giving birth. So after, it's like the nutrients the mom needs to regain its strength after giving birth because birth Why do you take it out of the really barn? Stuck. You take it out of the barn because wild animals come because it tastes really good. Which animals? Like coyotes, dogs, cats, foxes, and raccoons. Yeah. Oh, this is Rock Love. She's the Watch out, she's the, the baby's mother. in here. They're both in here. She's, she's the, the mother of all mothers. She's the mother of all the mothers. She's the sheep. She's the, like, the great-grandmother. Great and she's give, he's giving her milk. And she's... Rock Love's a really good mommy. Oh, it might be outside. No. Oh, it's in oh wow! Oh, look at this black one! Wow! Yeah. We have a, a totally oh, brown God. sheep and a totally that. white sheep. It's amazing. Rock Love gives the best... Uh, patterns for the sheep. Rakab is the grandma of all the sheep we have. Yeah. And or she, the mother. She bears the greatest patterns out of all the sheep here. The other sheep can give like spots, white spots and brown spots, but Rakab does stripes. Like caramel stripes and chocolate stripes. Yeah, you have them first. And you can tell that they're culture because they have a split hoof. Yes. Uh, most of them are Nubian goats, but Bexies and Ibex. Hi everyone, this is a baby lamb that I'm holding. He's very cute. He was just born yesterday. Come on, Rachav. Come on, Rachav. Rachav wants to go inside. She wants, she, wants. she wants to be with the babies. This is Marcus and Ramses. Huh? There's a knucklehead sheep, too. I don't know how this happened. I didn't do this. <laughs> Apple. Sure, I wouldn't hold it like that. Wait, wait, when a horse came, they taught us that you had to put it flat. I thought. Come on, come on. Come here. Come on, Zeus. Horses have rectangular pupils, which is really cool. Talking to him. Good boy, Zeus. You can tell how old a horse is by what their teeth look like. So if their teeth are flat like this, like 180 degrees, then you know that they're very young. But if their teeth are protruding outwards, then you know it's really old. Yep. Here comes the mom. The more they protrudes also... out, the older it is. Yeah. They're really cool. There's colors like, there's a chestnut. All right, can you give it to Chelsea, please? And they have also Zoe, where's the apple for Chelsea? Yeah, I put it, I don't know. We're um, talking to, to the birdies. Georgie. 
He's an emus. Good boy. Nice bird. What kind of bird is Georgie? Georgie's an emu. How do you say emu in Hebrew? Emu. 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 What can you guys tell us about emus? Uh, they they're they're come from patient. Australia. They like being in wet environments. They like being Dry hugged. Like being hugged. They come from Australia. They love being. They love water. What and they lay eggs. Like so they're they birds. Fly? They're do flightless they birds. They can't fly, and they can run really fast, faster they than have anyone. Tiny they, fly, they can run at 60 kilometers in like three to zero seconds. Zero to three seconds. And they also have, they're also good at. Can also uh, make their hairstyle cool like that. Right there. <laughs> yeah. Get Georgie in the sunlight. It's hard to see when he's in the shadow. Pull him over to show him. Show us his normal hair and then change his hairstyle. Okay. All right. This is normal hair. Straight up. Spiky. Yeah. All and right, this now is, give him a hairstyle. And then this is flat. No, slick it back like he's going to school. He's got to comb his hair in the morning. There he is. Yeah. Georgie needs <laughs> a keeper. Like... Oh. <laughs> we need to make a keeper for Georgie. Yeah, we do. Hi, Wilma and Yael. Yael, is that your baby emu? How old is Wilma? So we'll pause it over here. Um, so you're going to be responsible for the summary only through Psukim Aleph through Tet Zion. Um, I'll make that change in the assignment. And um, and so this is what happened. Okay, so guys, let's... let's, 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 let's